trigonometry. What was the lessons that you have learned in trigonometry? Anybody? Okay, Cloud. Trigonometric ratios like what? Okay, what else? What's another learnings from trigonometry? Cloud again? <laughs> Angles of elevation and depression. What is angle of elevation about? Anybody wants to say something about angle of elevation? Yes, give it. Okay, so it is above the line of horizontal line of sight. So uh, it involves angle of elevation if the observer is found below the object being observed. How about angle of depression? Angle of depression, anybody? What is angle of depression? Sansin. Below the horizontal line of sight to the object below the observer or being observed. So from the horizontal line of sight to the line of sight going to the object being observed. So the angle formed by that is what we call as angle of depression. Okay, what else have we discuss in trigonometry. Let us hear from uh, Japheth. What have we learned about trigonometry? Low cosines. What is the application of our law of cosines? What kind of triangle does it involve? It is oblique triangles okay so this time because we're done with the discussion of trigonometry we are now going to come into decision so is trigonometry useful into our lives is it important if so in what manner so that is what we are going to resolve this afternoon a debate on this motion. The house believes that trigonometry is important to our lives. So we have here the proponents, the affirmative and the negative side. So uh, students, please listen because later on you will be asked to give a reflection about the activity and on what side are you going to be in favor of. Okay, so may I call in our moderator for this afternoon's activity, Ms. Monique Abiru. Good afternoon, everyone. Today, we will have our math debate of Grade 9 Lewis School Year 2016-2017. Debating in the motion, this house believes that trigonometry is useful in our lives. House rules. Each speaker is given three minutes to entertain POI after the speech. No bad words allowed. Walang personalan. No name calling. No speaking of vernacular. And last, you are not allowed to monopolize the POI. In the government, we have Mikaela Angelique Zabalier. And Lawrence Angelo Adaya. Ashley Chio Kaime. Jaymar Ruiz. Francine L. Simon. And last, highest information. In the opposition, we have Ashley Marto 
Edvon Jan Kahal, Michael Cloud Cabangada, Damila Lois Picablanca, Nicole Casica, and last, Luis Ionova. Let us now welcome the panel of observers, Ma'am Edita F. Valmoria, Green Line Level Chairman. Ma'am Rita A. Galagala, Great Big Ma'am Evelyn B. Rabadan, English So now let's start our evening. tend to ask questions, eventually mathematics about the importance of this and that lessons. We are now in high school. Thus, we should learn another topic that is very important and relevant to our daily lives. Mathematics is a subject that is vital for gaining a better perspective on events that occur in the world, involving critical thinking and problem-solving abilities. This can enhance our skills in a particular subject. The primary application of trigonometry is found in scientific studies where precise distance needs to be measured. Some of this relevance of trigonometry in our lives. But one, techniques in te trigonometry are used for finding relevance in navigation. Satellite systems, astrono astronomy, naval and aviation industries, oceanography, land surveying, and cartography, which in making some land maps. Applying trigonometry function in solving a practical issue, fundamental backgrounds, some passion such as music that is really in music or fashion with this generation like us. Some terms and patterns in sign and cause and function that is really useful in computer music, and that's it. Another one is the more modern architecture. Curved in steel, stone, and glass would be impossible if not the immense potential of these signs. Digital imaging is another like real-life application of this marvelous science. When we said studying math is only an academic value, need other reasons to know how formally integrity make life easier for you. It's not literal that only formulations and such equations are the main points of having trigonometry. Even in decoration of your houses, you could relate in having exact angles and in positioning when deciding lighting arrangements. Even when you don't need to write out sign formulations for this. With this trigonometry is much useful in our lives. That's all. And with this trigonometry is much useful in our life. I will just continue my statement. Trigonometry wasn't found and we don't need to study about it, then we're still now in this stone age, or particularly we're being called like caveman. Our civilizations were not being enhanced and such technologies. And with that, truly learning mathematics with this trigonometry assures us and makes us being smart and adept at solving tricky situations, especially this subject or matter. That would be all thank you. Said, the government said that trigonometry is really important and we really have to learn it. Well, it is really hard to believe. Well, in fact, when Ma'am Ma Olohe was here and asking about trigonometry, you, you did not even participate, you did not even raise your hand. So if you're telling me that it's really important, you don't even know about that stuff. Okay. So. about Mr. Duterte, ladies and gentlemen. 
Okay, I, you can see as even Mr. President wants to replace trigonometry because he says that it's not it's it's, it's actually useless. Okay, okay, let's talk about Mr. President. He made he actually actually he actually made a statement last December. He said that if, if well, he was he still wasn't president that time, he, he's still elected. He said that if he would become the president of the Philippines, he would remove stuffs in math, specifically trigonometry. What is his reason? According to him, that there are a lot of Filipinos who's really struggling and really suffered from math anxiety, trying to learn these unnecessary numbers and signs that did not serve any practical purpose. Okay. He said that um, instead of instead of this trigonometry stuff, he would replace it to business, mathematics, and and statistics because it is more useful. Well, I do agree with him. The Mr. Pre Mr. President is right, especially when he said that a lot of people, Filipinos rather, suffer from from math anxiety. As a student, I encounter a lot of people or students break into a cold sweat and they start seeing complicated trying to stop the board. Like, oh my God, I cannot answer that, that's so hard. Okay, so why do you have to complicate things? Like, I mean, let's, all, let's all accept the fact that not everyone is actually good in math. So in reality, all we, we actually use is the basic, the addition, multiplication, division. I actually asked my mom last night, mom, do you know anything about trigon? No, I don't know, don't ask me. Okay, we cannot use that. And even when you're finding a job, let's face the fact that we cannot really use this one. If it says that it's important in our lives, if it if, if, if it's important in our life, it should it should be that we can we will really die if we won't learn trigonometry. Important is if you really say that it is important, yes, that's what I said. If, if you said that it's really important, like we would die not learning it, but no, it's not. But in fact, there are actually a lot of people who became successful without having, without even knowing tri what is trigonometry. Thank you. Ooh, no, I, I, the bottom line here is that we should not, the bottom line here is that trigonometry is, is useless. Before I will start my speech, let me rebut that it is not the point when not raising in hand it means we really don't know what is the topic. Not all are good in math, that's why we need to learn and learn and learn. So, we know that students doesn't like mathematics because for them mathematics is making their lives difficult. But for me, mathematics is important to us and it is very essential to us especially in trigonometry. Trigonometry is, a brand, is also a branch of mathematics and it means that as a student, we used to learn this, this topic. Many students say that trigonometry is a waste of time and is not useful in our lives. But definitely, you're wrong. Trigonometry is useful in real life. Did you know that because of trigonometry, we can measure a building's height without using any measurements material? Technology uses also trigonometry, like GPS. Architects use also trigonometry to sketch a proposal plan in order to attain correct measurement, or simply we can say symmetry and balance. Those astronauts also use trigonometry in order to have a correct location in space for taking off a rocket. And this is one of those few that prove that trigonometry is useful in our lives. There is a purpose why we need to learn this in order to apply it and make the best 
blessings in, in our life. And they want to prepare us into a better student who knows everything about trigonometry. Trigonometry help, uh, help me to understand more further explanation about or to explain the application of it in our daily lives. Science and math are fused together in order to make a change in our lives. Trigonometry makes our life more comfortable and the essential of this in our life is not relevant nowadays. There is a lot of application, application of trigonometry that is applicable in our lives. That's all. As a student, I strive hard and do everything for my studies, especially that I belong to the special curriculum of the Department of Education, which is the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. With and where high expectations from teachers and other students exist. With that, I have to balance, of course, my time, go up and to, to submit all the tasks on time. So now going back to the motion which states that is trigonometry useful, especially in our daily lives. Okay. Okay. So, I beg to disagree. Aside from it gives our students a burden, and those students continue on suffering with this trigonometry, this struggle isn't useful and can help people, especially those who are not good on mathematics, specifically the trigonometry task. So it is indeed hard to make a lot of students appreciate subject when they don't see any practical applications of it. So let me quote one of the statements of our president, Rodrigo Duterte. I quote, if I will be the president, I will remove calculus and trigonometry in the education system of our country. You know, you know there are crazy things. It does not serve the people, the purpose of all. Pinapahirapan lang yan ang mga bago. So that's a statement of our president. Of course, our president already admitted that he is not really that good in mathematics. And aside from that, he just wanted to end the suffering of those students who suffered Chinese So now let's ask focus on the motion. Is it really useful in our daily lives? I repeat, daily lives. So when, of course, there are courses who really, who really study and focuses on trigonometry, but when the actual, especially those courses, architecture and engineering, they don't really actually, all, they don't always, they don't always use trigo when they plan, uh, plan to build buildings and structures. So let me focus on the motion. Considering that not all establishments are triangle and has triangle. So I do believe, for me, the four basic operations such as addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division are enough for us to learn, and especially in our daily lives. So these four basic operations are things that we have to learn and we can use it in our daily lives. So I do believe that the Department of Education should remove the trigonometry in our education system here in our country. So that would be all they need. Before I start my speech, let us rebut the uh, speech of Mr. Kahal. So, if other students can learn mathematics, such as trigonometry, then why others can't? It is just a matter of laziness, and they really don't like math. We all have aspects and goals in life, but we really need this trigonometry. So, go back to the topic. This house believes that trigonometry is useful and more important in our lives. I agree in this motion. Because in the first place, why is it created or discovered if it is it was useful, it was useless, I mean, in our lives lives. So now this makes sense. The techniques in trigonometry are used for finding relevance in navigation, particularly satellite systems and astronomy, naval and creation industries, oceanography, land surveying and 
Petrography. Most of the map we study would seem to have little real life application. That's what people think, but no. We are actually surrounded by various applications of trigonometry. On our daily life, but honestly, we are not aware of this fact. It will be possible to construct houses, cars, and etc. without the knowledge of trigonometry. We do not mean that the entire process is based on trigonometry, but certain, certain measurements and concepts are actually based on this important mathematics topic. Similarly, there are research manufactured and developed through the use of some trigonometric concepts. So is trigonometry important? Definitely yes. It is vital for gaining a better perspective on events that occur in natural world or the one we call life or lives. Just about just every bit of technology you use involves it. So if you listen to a weather forecast to see what the weather is going to be, that depended on trigonometry. If you drive a car or fly in a plane, that depends on trigonometry. Reading sentences on, a, on an electronic device that depends that depends on trigonometry. If you use computers, telecommunications, yeah, telecommunications and electronic power source or anything that uses any of these things, that depends on trigonometry. Most of civilization depends on trigonometry. So if you're part of it, you use trigonometry in real life and it is useful. So that is you all. As we all know, trigonometry is a very hard lesson. Trigonometry makes our life miserable. It is very hard to understand. You know, there are crazy things in trigonometry. It does not serve any pur purpose at all. It makes the students suffer. There seem to be many unnecessary subjects and topics in South Philippine schools. It is indeed hard to make a lot of students appreciate the subject and they don't see any practical application for it. I think it worsens the lack of interest and motivation of a few students to continue going to school. However, in my case, if there would be any subject that I want to be taken out in the system, it would be calculus and trigonometry. So, some students cannot connect what they are studying in real life situations. Ask some engineering students to solve a simple calculus problem and they will even gladly show how they will do it, but ask them the basis, the basis of the formulas they use, or ask them to derive those formulas themselves. Most of them will just scratch their head. Um, for my example, if you're tasked to buy something in a grocery store, you can use the concept of trigonometry. So there is no use. Hey, for me, trigonometry is not useful in our daily lives. Another example, when you're buying food in the canteen, you can apply the concept of trigonometry. So that's all. Thank you. Before I, before I start, Why others can? And as I said, it's just a matter of interest in that subject. And and first of all, I would like to rebut what Miss Martin said. We came here to school to learn, not not to complain. And strive hard so that you can you, you can teach your child or grandchildren of about trying to make so let's go back to the math. We know that math is difficult, but nothing on earth is easy if you do not stop striving hard. Based on history, we facts that, that they use trigonometry to calculate the positions of planets and stars. We do not mean that the entire process is based on trigonometry, but certain measurements and concepts are actually based on this important mathematical topic. 